history, Misha Tate versus Kat Zingano. What was it like for you to actually get the call from the UC to become part of the bantamweight division? I was just overwhelmed and excited, and I couldn't believe that I had been chosen, but I knew I'm the right one for the job. Well, everything was just happening exactly the way it's supposed to. I love it. Being in the UFC is the end-all, be-all, the, the top of the place that you wanted to be. It was the NFL. It was the NBA. It was, you know, to some people, the Olympics. Fighting out of Brookfield, Colorado. I just remember walking out and it was this sea, it was like this ocean, this wave of faces. And every single person was looking at me. It was very surreal and it was very bright and new and shiny and unreasonable. I'm just thinking, oh my God, everything that I've gone through to finally get here. This woman is a grappler, holding a professional record, 13 wins. Three Misha wins. was the Strike Force World Champion, and it was this underdog that was not heard of. Holding a professional record, seven wins, no losses. I think that they expected Misha to go out there and get that win. And we are underway immediately. Tate takes the center of the octagon. Yeah, Tate not wasting any time going right at Zingano. Trying to see how she responds. Tate now with a nice combination. And Zingano is stunned. The bell goes off, and she uses my face to get up. At that point, I felt territorial. I see Kat Zingano comes forward with a flying knee. Zingano trying to reverse and counter that takedown. And now some big shots with the right hand. And Kat Zingano's just mean, man. Misha Tate gets back to her feet and immediately is dropped by a knee. And how much more can Misha Tate take? I definitely felt her break. I felt her want out. I had accomplished taking her will, and it was done. It, fight's over. Kat Zingano is your number one contender. And this is a dream come true, and I can't be more grateful for the good, the bad, the ugly. This is where I belong. <laughs> this was the second fight in UFC history of women, and we got fight of the night. You know, we, we wowed the world.